Hello everybody, my name is Shredder X and welcome back to RimWorld and hopefully not the death of Arthur because we only have six days left everybody until it's winter. I actually thought I had more time but I forgot this game's months are only 15 days so yeah. Not great everybody, not great. But I have a plan, we're going to have a plan to quickly change some stuff around and hopefully survive the upcoming month of destruction. So we're going to put, uh, we're going to convert some stuff around. We're going to get rid of Ryman, Arthur, wake up, get rid of her. And when I say get rid of, I mean just tear to leave. <laughs> I don't want to murder her, that's a bit too harsh. We're just going to get rid of her. So um, what we do, we get rid of her there. We make this into the little cooking room. We make sure it's locked off from the animals and stuff. Problem solved. And she's gone. Perfect. And we will also make this into some kind of like pseudo... Actually, what we should do instead. Let's do that instead. That works out. Right, that was not what I wanted you to copy game. I want you to copy this this thing here done okay so we have like an extra door going outside and this can just be like a kind of a fridge but also not having to worry about the food spoiling because right now it's inside so it's spoiling from just being too hot but if i put it outside even if it's frozen it will still just dis disappear because well it's outside <laughs> animals can you not animals leave me be let's make an uh, let's make a location for the animals to leave me be shall we i should probably should be playing on fast let's play on level one for now Let's make a animal zone. Where is area one anyway? Does area one even exist? It doesn't. Okay, manage areas, animals. We'll just call it the barn. The barn. Perfect. Get out. <laughs> well, I should have to tell me get out, sorry. Get out. Leave my house alone. Get out of here. Perfect. Arthur, focus on making the wall. Queens and just make some holes in these walls and stuff as well. Well, I just realized I actually just locked in Wolf. <laughs> He's stuck there forever. I'm sorry, buddy. You can never leave now. Okay, luckily I did it this way around because if I did it the other way around, we would have an open area, which would be a bit of a disaster. We do need to make sure we move the fire though, so we probably put the cooking in like. Uh... To be fair, now we got rid of the animals, we probably just cook in the main room here. We'd probably be fine. Uh, no, just temporarily. We will build the proper building thing, uh, cooking thing inside this area, but just for now, we'll move it around a bit. Good job. And can you also do that as well? So I presume right now we're getting quite cold because I've just kind of lost those of our heating. Nice. Okay, get rid of that. Arthur, do as I say. Nice. Okay, so we cook the food here in groups of... Is it really... I'm trying to think, do I actually want to do it in groups of four or is it just better to do it? I don't think it's more efficient to do it in groups of four or do it in groups of one. Is there like a time difference somewhere? Work to make five, work to make 20. It's exactly the same. Wait, no, it's not. No, it is, sorry. Yes, yeah, 0 0.5 raw food equals one simple meal. We'll just well do what we're doing before. We'll just keep this going. Make 20 food, please. Oh, that's... Oh! I thought this meant it was making um, 20 times 4, not 20 like twenty individual meals. In that case then, can I just uh, change that a little bit? How much food do you reckon we need? Like 100? That's probably a bit excessive. This is your 40 for now. Okay, Arthur. Uh, final thing you need to do is open this door. And also we're going to put down... Actually, we could probably just switch this around as well. Delete that. All the medicine away. Get rid of the crafting spot as well. And we're going to put in the stockpile zone for food. So we have all raw food here. And we'll also keep... Actually, there's no reason not to keep food as well, really. Oh, we'll leave it as this. We'll keep all the raw food here. And we'll also get rid of all the animal corpses. And I think that should work out pretty well. Force open. Done. So this should now act as an indoor frozen location once we open the door. No, the food! Wait, it's cooking on the fire! Oh no! Wolf, quickly! Or is that on purpose? That might be on purpose. I'll take it back. Anyway, apart from all that, next thing we need to try and focus on, of course, is going to be heating. Because right now, we need to get this puppy up and running in the next few days. Where is he? Temperature heater, this fella. Now, the problem with this, though, is that it requires construction skill of five. And I've already got construction skill of four. So we don't really have what we need to do this right now, which is a bit scary. Uh, but I think if we just focus a little bit, we should be okay. Um, kill these animals. We need food. Good job, buddy. 
I'm hoping that it's kind of weird to say. I'm hoping the random events might help me a little bit with getting me like either some animals to kill or like some maybe resources or weapons. I don't know, but hopefully the game throws me a solid one and we can survive. <laughs> if not, I guess I'll just die. But we'll see what happens. So we're gonna need, I think, around like 400 odd metal to get all this built up. So I'm gonna tell them to go mine over here, and I think there was a random thing up here. Yes, get rid of that. Oh, was there more steel walls before I do this? Maybe we shouldn't mine, we should just deconstruct. That's probably a better idea. Uh, let's go and deconstruct all these walls. Aha! I didn't think about this. Is there more somewhere? So this is concrete. Uh, concrete. Still? Still! Yes! Feed me ruins! Do you reckon that'd be enough for now? We got more if we need to, though. Because actually, quick, I think the problem we got right now is, uh, um, does that help construction skill? This might actually be the West Bay of doing it, because if we do it that way, I think we get construction skill from deconstructing. What is this? Blaster Silvus, Senator of the Eastern Republic, is requesting a favor. His friend Lunia Curius <laughs> is interested in learning about other cultures. He wants you to host her at Valor for four days. Does that mean as a guest or as a worker? I don't know, but we could get him off. Are you good at stuff, Moth? Are you useful? <gasps> Cooking! Medicine! In oh, this is amazing! Uh, they're really good at taming as well, and wow. Yes, you can join us. I accept. So, are you useless, random person? She's not! We got two for the price of one! This is perfect. Okay, so we've got a friend helping us out now. She's good at smithing tailoring, which may sound a bit annoying at the moment, but we do need to make new clothes and whatnot. So we will work on that. Um, and also you can research as well, so we can get the ability to get batteries as well. This is great. This is really handy. So we're going to do that. Oh no, a solar flare. All of my electronics will turn off. I have none, by the way. Uh, let's see. Order cancel. I didn't really need grass, buddy. I'm not going to lie to you. <laughs> Go and do something else. We'll put the grass in later. Okay, good, 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 good. So we're also, as she's here now, we're also going to focus on getting some tailor benches. We have no wood, though. We need wolf to get wood. Wasn't she good at cooking? No, but she can cook temporarily so Wolf can focus on other things. So we'll do that. Also, we haven't got a butcher bench, have we? I deleted it. <laughs> ah! Ah! Bit of a problem. Um, how do we deal with that then? We need to butcher things. So we also put down a butcher bench, which we can't do because we've got no wood. Ah! Maybe I didn't put this in the best place. <laughs> it's actually in a bit of a bad place. I guess we can do... Put that there. We'll move this out of the way. I have another one here. We'll move that out of the way and put it up here. Yeah, be fine. Do we actually not have enough wood for this? We don't. Uh, Wolf, can you just... He's hauling wood, which is great, but we need like 60 or 90 wood, I think. Kill that tree. Murder the tree. And also, while we're running around, let's also get... Uh, oh, I'm a bit scared about attacking these muffalo, but we'll see what happens. We did have wood available, but I think we just spent too much of it on other stuff. So we've got 54. We need more. We need more. Oh, that's what I wanted to avoid happening. Um, but it's Arthur, though. He's fine, right? Oh. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. Maybe we should hunt in squads. So we can quickly gank any ammo we come across. I'm stunned. Oh, no. Don't tell me you're going to die from this. Oh, okay. We're okay, we're okay. Ooh. Bit, bit scary. How bad are you hurt? Oh, bruises. That's fine. Bites is what I'm worried about if we get an infection. So I think I'm okay with that. Okay, Wolf. Uh, you still cut jam trees, right? Yes, you are. And Lunia is doing a great job doing research for us. 
Can you make- we still haven't got enough? You gotta be kidding me. Oh! I forgot to move the elf me! No! <laughs> no! Well, that was my fault. That's fine. No, Arthur, don't do- oh, damn it, man. Just cut all these trees down. We're getting enough wood anyway, right? You're picking up all the wood or you're just not getting any wood? Uh, hopefully it's the latter there, because... Eat your food. And then prioritize the... Damn it, game. <laughs> How much wood do I need to get? Well, I know what it says, 90, but apparently I need to get way more than I think I do. We need to get some more wood from somewhere. Also, it's over here as well. Just go and cut down more trees, man. The Emperor of Elnor is attacking me. That's, that's brilliant. Oh, I didn't check. Are they attacking right away? Yes? I was expecting more danger from the Emperor of... Oh, they're actually pretty good at fighting, which is a bit scary. Uh, and also, I'm already hurt, which is even more scary. Uh, let's get everybody together. She probably needs to help us fight. Is she good at fighting? No. she pro We probably shouldn't use her in combat. I'm going to put that out there right now. Okay, so what do we want to do here? So we're going to have two archers. Let's put them two down there. And we'll have Lunia around the back. And when the guy comes through, she can come and help stab him. Oh, they're not doing it yet. Sorry. Carry on. Carry on, everybody. Carry on. Slightly more resource so we can start butchering again. It kind of sucks having the butchering table in here, but it'd be fine. We have loads of wood! I knew we had enough! Okay, I'll calm down. I'm sorry, everybody. I knew the game was swindling me there. I just... <laughs> the game lied. It was all a lie. Butchering table. Do it forever. Can we just heal this before it becomes a problem? I'm just a bit concerned about it. Wait, were you not a doctor or something? Or is that me just forgetting? No, but you are better than... Oh. <laughs> you are better than a uh, wolf, so you can do that. Okay, they're attacking now. Uh, everyone to get outside. Ignore the issues. We'll deal with it later. Get outside, everybody. Okay, so back to where we were earlier. Everyone go over here. And we'll use Lunia to help stab the guy in a second. Hello there. Begin the shooting! <clears throat> Arthur? Arthur? Are you gonna... There you go. Begin the shooting! <laughs> oh wait, the other way around. Back up a little bit, buddy. Okay, that's not what I wanted to happen. Close combat right away. Do not let her take the damage. Okay, go, go! Did we just disarm her weapon or something? Nice! Good job, everybody. Good job. Uh, you're dead. Sorry. <laughs> Wait, they're still alive. We can quickly just pick them up and release them just to get some free relations, I guess. Um... You two should go and heal. You capture. Arthur, go to bed. <laughs> Arthur. He doesn't want to go to bed. I wish you could uh, just tell them to go and rest in their own beds. Don't help her. Kick her out. Oh, it's not letting me do it. Whatever, it's fine. Uh, we probably should focus on myself first. I don't really care much about this random person. Endangered animals. Rockhopper penguins. Are they over here somewhere? Oh my god, they're adorable! Oh, interesting. We must protect these poor penguins and make sure they survive in this harsh environment. It's totally fine. Well, you actually took quite a few hits there, but luckily there's only one. The stab is what I'm worried about. I don't know if it's just me. I always only ever seem to get infections from stab wounds or like bites. I don't seem to get problems with bruises, but maybe it's just me. So this person may die, actually. So they don't. Kick her out before it's our problem. Wait, just get, get rid of her. Feeding, tending. 
Damn it. <laughs> Kick her out. I don't want to get the uh, debuff from letting a prisoner die. Wait until Thingy's woken up in the morning. Won't let me do it. Is it because she's ill? Maybe she can't walk. It's probably because... Oh, she probably can't move right now. That's why. As soon as she heals, we'll get rid of her. Okay, Arthur, what were you doing? You were making... Oh, we got the thing. Very nice. We also need to get rid of this urn. I said... Deploy the urn! Perfect. Okay, next we're going to make a thingy table. If I can find it. Uh, give me a second, everybody. Wait, why am I butchering in this room? I made a mistake, didn't I? Uh, it, whatever. <laughs> we'll move it in a second. It's fine. We'll just make sure we clean up first. I do definitely want to make a thingy bench, though, to make more clothes. Uh, pay bench. Perfect. Okay, so we can use this to quickly make ourselves some better clothes. I'm going to start off with the Trevor hats. Because uh, these give you like 10 odd. I think it's 10. Yeah, I think yeah, I think it gives you 10 extra protection against the cold. Which would be very handy for us. Arthur. Um, I need to get rid of this person already. But she's kind of just hanging around. Go back out and kill the moose. And I guess some more muffalo as well. All still sleeping, but he can go and get some more trees and stuff we can use to do this. I guess we're also making mine. Everybody mine if they need to at the end. No one's good at mining anyway, so it doesn't matter who does it really. That could be, 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 be. This is not the place I want to be. <laughs> we made a mistake, everybody. Should we butcher in the prisoner room to freak out the people? <laughs> I'm a bit excited about this. Can you go for that one instead because it's by itself? And can we also call out water help? I keep thinking these are animals. They're not. They're just random dead things. Nice. There's a baddie rabbit. And it's fresh! Pick up. I didn't think we were storing animals in here. Oh, is it because I made a mistake? Aha! I made a mistake, everybody. I made a mistake. Preferred. Major break risk me. Is it because I'm hungry? No, it's because of everything. <laughs> There's so many reasons we lost count. There's only 12 days. Oh, three days for 12 days. So three days left until we're certain destruction, everybody. At least we got some help. Uh, did she actually research? Oh, she's nearly researched batteries. That would be helpful as well. I guess temporarily we could just butch. I don't like butchering cold temperatures, but it'd be better than nothing, right? Just so it's in this zone instead. In the morning, I get Arthur to move it. Because that should be enough food anyway. Oh, this should be forced open. Oh, I oh no. It's only 11 degrees in here. That's actually fine, to be fair. I'm not worried about that. The mood is a bit of a problem, though. Um, eight without table, awful bedroom. You've got a pot, though. What do you mean, man? You've got a pot and everything. They're so ungrateful, these people. Wait, what's your construction skill? Four. There's not much point making that get higher, unless it's really close to leveling up. No, it's at the start. It'd be better to keep with Arthur, because Arthur's already, like, halfway through. So, can you, um, quest available deserter? So he's, he's going to bribe us with knowledge, but we get, we annoy the empire, which I don't want to do. So, so now I've literally got the empire inside my territory right now. Wait, 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 clean up. No, 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 no. Someone clean the blood quickly. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, he's hunting again. I think this is the last thing I asked him to hunt anyway. Oh, nice. We got rid of that person. Good job, everybody. Good job. So. Get rid of this bed. I guess we could temporarily butcher in here. Ah, I'll be fine. Whatever. 
The animals aren't hungry yet, by the way, so they're still okay, apparently. I guess if I gave them a larger area, they might have been okay just eating the plants, but that might be a problem in the winter anyway. Ah, oh, he's doing it now. Let's go check. So, does this actually count? That's what I was curious about earlier. So, if I go to social... Ah, it does count. Beautiful. Uh, can we get you off cleaning? Because you're not actually cooking anyway. It's just the guys that like cleaning, uh, cooking that should be doing that. There you go. Fish. Where do we get a fish from? I guess maybe the penguins picked up the fish. Is this thing not dead yet? <laughs> We definitely need a better weapon, though. Got it. Nice! That should be enough food. Got loads of food now. Perfect. We're also looking pretty good with other stuff as well. I uh, should also put down... Oh, very good. Sorry, I'm an idiot. So she should start making clothes as well shortly. Which helps out massively. But she, I, I, it's okay she's cooking first because this shouldn't spoil. It does spoil. I'm an idiot. What am I doing, everybody? Uh, keep that in there as well. I'm so sorry. I'm such an idiot. There you go. Everyone do that. Of course it's going to spoil. It's, it's in that I'm such a fool. Okay. There you go. That should be fine, right? Won't spoil fresh. That's what we want to see. Who are you? Gerald. <gasps> wow! Super cook. Fast walker. Uh. Ah. Uh. Kind of sucks, everybody. Kind of sucks. I don't think he would join us if we rescue him. If he does, we can just. Wait. Oh, we're going to leave him. Sorry, everybody. I don't want to take the risk of him being in our group because i think we get a debuff every time we abandon somebody so we're just whatever <laughs> he may be fine you never know he may get back up again oh you built something a hat so this hat should be way better right so it's got 10 insulation from cold are we gonna put it on hopefully we will because that will give us an additional uh where's my gear some reason he's wearing this, so I'm not sure why. Additional 10, so he go down to negative 35 degrees. Still not good enough, actually. That's not actually good enough for the winter. We need to be at least negative 40, I think. Which is actually crazy to think about it. That is that is cold, everybody. That is cold. But I think things are going okay. We're, we're getting there. We've got loads of food. It should last us a little bit. We had to probably feed our animals. Oh, I didn't think about that. Um, I guess what we could do, we can have like a single spot where we just put food in here. We'll leave it a little bit. It's just, it's just minor malnourishment. It's fine. <laughs> Whatever. It's not a problem. Unfortunately, they keep coming into here and that's what I want to try and avoid them doing. Can I do like a no entry zone? Is that a thing? I'm gonna go with no. Did we fish? How does this work? I don't know. This fishing's in the mods, right? Let's get rid of that. Too small. That's a quite a big zone, though. What about this place? Let's do a big fishing zone. We are. Oh, <laughs> um, it, it can fish. That's pretty cool. Let's just see what happens with that then, because I think we have some fishes, don't we? Loon is really good at fishing, and so is Wolf. That could be quite helpful. No, that's, that's not fish. Sorry, that's fish. I'm good at fishing. Okay, looks like we're also about to finish the barn as well, which would be pretty handy. Is that all we're getting from these deconstructions? That's not great to be honest, but soon you should be more focused on doing it. Okay, I think the last thing we need in this barn is some kind of heat source. So we're just going to put down one of these campfires. Now, in a previous, I have tried for quarters before and I died horribly to a flu infection. Then I got hit by a thunder strike. It was, it was just crazy. But anyway, um, this is no better than this. So the game lies when it says it's better. It's just outlines you. 
Uh, so I'm just going to do a regular campfire and this could be like a nice warm place for the animals. I wish you just do multiple of these just to smash through it. I'm just going to tell you to do it myself. <laughs> now these walls aren't very good for getting resources from, but what is pretty good is these doors. I think it's like 25 resources per. Oh! What the hell? Great, you just killed Wolf. Great, good job. <laughs> wow, that sucks, everybody. I am so unlucky in this game. It's ridiculous. Uh, let's see. So Wolf's probably dead, I'm going to say. Um, it's just bruises and cracks, though. Damn it, man. Uh, Tend to Wolf. Wolf's dying. So hopefully without anything that's like... Fro Wait, actually, switch that out. You do your own thing. Let's bring in Looney to do it. You need to help him. You get back to what you're doing. <laughs> Stupid. Okay, perfect. And this is so good because it's going to give us deconstruction skills. Oh, we're going to get there. We're going to get there. We've only got two days left though, which is kind of scary. <laughs> I probably should tend to your illness, Ill wounds as well. The wolf's fully healed now, right? Nitty. When he goes to bed, I'll get Luna to go and help him. No, no, no. No, we can't have more animals. I can't afford all this. I I'm sorry, you're dying. I don't care if you're an adorable little lizard. I can't afford to have that many animals. I'm sorry. I could barely afford what I got right now. Don't mess up my my thing, please. <laughs> Stop going in outside the, the freezer door. It's pretty handy having this random person here, though. Good. Wolf's back to normal. Wolf, don't you dare do that again. I, I will banish you. I don't care. Sorted, sorted, everyone can sleep again. Hunt and lack range weapon. I wonder why you... Where, where did you fight me? Get your weapon. Okay, so in the morning, we've, like I said, we've only got one day left until winter starts. And we have not got what we need to do, what we need to do, everybody. It's not looking good. So we need to get at least one of these up and running. Which I think we may have resources for with all this steel we've collected. So that might be okay. And then we need to hopefully get Arthur up to level 5 so we can get a heater. And then, then we should be okay. Uh, and after that, we'll focus on other stuff. Or we can kind of like emergency feed these animals. That might help us out. The other way of doing it though would just be having a single spot in here. Um, just for some food. It would be frozen here anyway, right? Indoors, negative 33 degrees. <laughs> wow, that's not good, is it? Um, zone, stockpile, bada bing. We just call this critical. And we just have meals. Which is only preferred, right? Yeah, that should work. Problem with malnourishment is, is they need to eat more food if they are malnourished, so. I'm also really tempted to kill one of my Mega Sloths because this due to how bad it's going to be when it gets to winter. But we'll see what happens, I guess, if we actually need to panic and do that. Okay, so people are working. Good times, good times. Please build one of these. Level 5! We've done it, everybody! Nice! We can now build a hill to heater. We can do this! We can survive! <laughs> it's going to be a close one, though. You, you can take more than that, you know. you got a backpack on. You can take, like, all of it in one go. You didn't even take enough to finish off the... Whatever, it's fine. Um... 
We do some more hunting at some point as well. Did you get tended, Arthur? You did. Sorry, I forgot about that. What is Lunia doing right now? She's praying. She should also be working at some point as well. Oh, very nice. Unfortunately for me, this is probably too far away to connect, so we also need to build the second one. But there's no reason why I can't do a, a sneaky disallow. That probably be a better idea. And then once we've done that, we will then set up the... You okay, Arthur? Don't freak out, buddy. We're so close to being alive. Just hang in there, man. Comfort, come on. There you go, mood's fine. It's not a problem. Yeah, so what we're focused on next, because we run out of wood anyway, is we need to get the heater going. So we'll put the heater in the main room. This should be way better than the campfire. Uh, so we put the heater up here. And we also need to get some vents going as well. So we'll make sure we vent this entire area. Um, that should work. There you go. So it doesn't matter if we can't afford to actually make the vents with this steel, because it requires 40 per. If it's this open area, it should help us out anyway, so it's fine. It's getting a bit dodgy, everybody. We're getting a bit close to destruction here, so hopefully we can survive. Also, I was going to remove this from a home location, so they stopped. Uh, they actually stop cleaning in the barn. But let's face it, we don't need to clean the barn. <laughs> Leave the barn alone, it's totally fine. Okay. That's fine, don't care about that. Hey, Wolf, you are cutting down trees, right, buddy? There's some trees left marked. We need more. We need more trees. Trees for the tree god, as they always say. Um, can you make this? Ooh. That's really bad. That really sucks. It's not... Okay, it's going for me. Good, good, good. Oh, that's bad. That's what I want. That's not what I wanted. That was opposite of what we want, everybody. Probably better if I do shoot, actually, instead of just stab. Uh, Luna needs to get out of there. She needs to leave. She's going to die otherwise. Luna, run away. Run away. Wait, take over aggro. He has the best chance of doing this. How bad are you hurt? Pretty bad. Okay, good. Uh, get her back in bed. No, don't rescue. No, don't rescue. Don't rescue. Kill. Make sure it doesn't get back up. We need to make an emergency bed to get Thingy in. Um, to be fair, we probably just make this a emergency bed. No! Kill it! Kill it! <laughs> Is it dead? It's dead. Okay, go over here quickly. No, actually, Wolf probably... No, I'll be there. Don't bleed to death, please! Ooh. Yeah, we'll use it. It'll be fine. If we don't use it quickly anyway, she'll probably get infection if we don't heal this quickly as possible. So, Also, I don't think we would have used the entire medipack. Oh, we have. I thought I had... Okay, I thought I had some spare, but I... that was actually my last one. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. It's fine. Dude! Done. Okay, we now have power, right? Into this location. We also need to get this heater working. Uh, we need... Oh, I can't tell. You're bleeding to death, by the way, Arthur. Just to point it out. Just so you're aware, you're not having a good time either. Uh, where is Wolf? We cannot risk these people get dying from blood loss here, so... That's fine. Get back to work. <laughs> You've had your rest. I'm fine with her resting because she got hit pretty bad, so.
Okay, what do we need for this? Um, steel and component. We have a component. We just need the steel. Which I don't think we have enough of whatsoever. So we currently have four steel, which is not great. Wasn't there another place I could disassemble? Perfect. This between these bits here should give me enough steel to make the heater. I just want to be pretty careful about something though. So we just do this. Are they sleeping right now? No, but what we'll do, we'll tell them to do not build these yet. Build the heater only. Oh, this is stressful. We'll get there though. It's fine, everybody. We can believe. And we can survive winter starting in around a few hours. <laughs> oh, no. I only got 12. That's way under what I wanted. He's not having a good time. How she? Do you reckon she's enjoying her stay? Learning about new environments and stuff? We probably shouldn't cook here right now. I'm just going to point out the blood everywhere. You might want to deal with that. Okay, perfect. <laughs> ah, wolf came out of nowhere. That kind of sucks. <gasps> wow. Thank you so much. I don't know why I have these, but I can sell them at some point, probably. We, we run out of food. Oh my god. We've got some food over there, but the animals, but... Use a lot of food there. She's not doing a very good fast job here because of her injury. You realize you can. Oh, I see what's happened here. Uh, hide away. Yeah, we need to get ourselves some more food and stuff as well. Um, but we probably should try and make Arthur focus on the heater first. Although we are okay right now. No, we're not okay. It's not good, actually. <laughs> we're not okay at all. It's not okay. Also, wait, I didn't think about this. How am I going to get that connected into there? I should have thought about that. There you go. Okay, Arthur. Good boy. It may be quicker, actually, just to do mining, but... Do as I say! Do as I say! <laughs> this should be enough, right? Uh, that yeah, should be enough. Oh, that wasn't really what I wanted you to do. Okay, whatever. It's fine. Instead then, can we make him just go and make the printer? that work, right? Aha! Take that, game! Hey, what happened to you? Frostbite! Oh no! <gasps> um, build the heater. Don't you dare break it. Good boy. Okay, build this. No wood. Oh no! Quickly! Quickly! Arthur, go down here to pick up the materials. So we need to hopefully get 20 wood. Excellent. Okay, get the wood. Build a campfire. He's already doing it. He doesn't even need me to tell him. He knows his situation. Quickly! Whatever, it's fine. Okay, well, I think we fixed it. But only just. <laughs> okay, so we've got a heater now. It's not being powered though because I put the electric circuits in the bottom of the base. <gasps> no! Then build that. Is that not close enough? Oh, you missed one, man. You missed one. The heater is online. Is it going to be enough by itself to heat this entire area? Even if it can't do that well, if as long as it's not like negative 30 or something, it should be okay. Hopefully. 
Probably when we get the fire going as well to cook more, which might be okay then. Okay, so we got the heater up, which is great. So we can go back to just building these vents now, just to make the rooms rooms again. Uh, we need to make sure Wolf actually does stuff. Food, though, is still a big problem, so we probably need to send out Arthur now to go and do some hunting. And it's the 2nd of December, I didn't even realise. Okay, so we're firmly in winter now, which is terrifying. That's probably why the heat is having so much trouble. But like I said, as long as it doesn't get too cold, it's fine. Uh, and hopefully the windmill just carries on windmilling. It should be okay though, I think. Blocked by birch tree. Oh, I didn't see that. A half tender. A who? The tiger slayer. <laughs> what? Oh, you put, you put the sunglasses on. That's pretty cool. Okay, she's she's ended a craziness mode. Oh, everybody, we're in such big trouble. We need to survive an entire month like this, and we've already got no food in the bank, which is a complete disaster. So it's kill, kill these animals as quickly as possible. Hopefully Arthur doesn't get killed. We'll have to see what happens. Oh, it's still over here as well. Who's this guy? Oh, I was like, I abandoned. <laughs> How could I forget? Need a better bow. What's this? Caravan is the central republic of being harassed by a pack of two man-hunting Norwegian forest cats. What? That's such a random combination. Um, so we can get bear pelts. We can get loads of stuff. I will definitely do this because killing two cats should be easy. Venom Talon. What is this? A retractable finger talon connected to a venom pump in the lower arm. This is insane. No, thank you. <laughs> I think we're going for the bear pelt. Because we can just use this to improve like the look of the area. So people aren't as unhappy all the time. Also, we get plow still as well. Oh, no. Oh, goodwill. They may come and help me in combat situations. Solar pinhole. What is that? Um... It surrounds the area. Oh. Oh, I, I don't know everybody. We'll probably go for... um. We'll go for this one. I'll take my Venom Talon. <laughs> In the future, it'd be pretty cool. And if we need to sell it, we can sell it as well, I guess. But Have you been cutting wood? Please say yes. And also, Wolf, can you not hunt? Because you're a bit weak right now. I don't really want you to die. So just don't hunt. Just cut down trees and stuff. Also, it'd be great if you, someone can refuel this fire. No, just, you know, so we don't die. Good. <laughs> He's going to get wood. Four wood. Oh, wait, he's picking stuff up. Sorry, I thought he only had four wood in total. I was like, what the hell? Okay, prioritizes the uh, the, the lights. <laughs> okay, they're, they're here. What kind of cat is that? That's a huge cat. Oh, no. Okay, where are you? Uh, he's going to head back anyway. Wolves outside. There they are. Okay, so we're probably going to need all of them. Lunia probably can fight if we need her to. Yeah, she can fight as well. Okay, abandon. I don't attack from the right hand side, damn it. <laughs> Good guys, good, good, good. Nice! Good job, everybody. Okay, so we have some minor injuries. We need to tend them, though. To be fair, it's night time right now. If we just leave it a bit, they should go to bed and I can make them tend each other, so. Oh, there's a muffler right here. Oh, wait, you're cooking around blood from your, yourself. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, this sucks. Okay, uh, help. Help, 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 help. 
Dude, back up, back up. Are you fast than this muffalo? It can't get past. Oh, no, my fence. Oh, no. Back up. Through the fence again. Go, go. <laughs> We're going to kite through the fence. It's fine. Attack me. No, attack me, muffalo. Wolf, help. Ooh, we're tough, Buffalo. We we survived again. <laughs> oh my god! Uh, make more, I guess. Most. Oh, I got my stuff. Yay! Uh, I guess we can just put this in like here. Uh, we're installed. That are people sleeping now? Yes, they are. So, you need to be healed. This heater is slowly working, by the way. We're up to 10 degrees in here now. So, this 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 is literally saving our lives right now. This is not perfect doing this, by the way. I need to think about a better way of doing it. Um, but for now, we just have to make do. Oh, uh, wasn't... She was also hurt as well. Can you also do that? You think by now the bleeding would stop? Do they have like leukemia or something? It seems a bit weird. Because I think leukemia. Am I right about that, by the way? I'm pretty sure leukemia is one of the biggest tells of leukemia was that you bleed and you just don't stop bleeding. Like your body, your blood, I think your blood's thin or something. So it doesn't actually like stop. It just carries on going where normally you get scars and stuff. So I don't know. I don't know. Oh, she's leaving. She is in three days. We'll, we'll keep her for a little bit longer just so she can help us out a little bit. But then we get a new person, right? Help us, Lumia. Help us. I feel... Look at this poor cat. I feel so bad. No, keep butchering animals. <laughs> get ready in a minute. Um, don't cook, please. Wait, wasn't the new person a cook? You just go now. Just, oh, no, no, before you go. Did she make free hats? She made hats for everybody. Oh, I didn't even notice. Cool. Uh, what else can you make before you leave? We're going to make it to make, <laughs> make stuff for me. You will make me stuff. We also need to get some undershirts. So we need three of those if we can. Just make me shirts, please. So, oh, Arthur, buddy. No, don't, no. Don't, don't do that. No. Great. <laughs> Good job, buddy. A poor shirt. You think it'd be better than that. But it's good, though, because Wolf's wearing it now. So, Wolf, what's your um thing, then? He's only negative what? Are we missing a Parker? I think Parker will probably be the better choice, actually. I didn't use it for some reason, though. Second shirt. These are pretty helpful. They go under the coat anyway, and it gives you like an extra... Where is it? Five degrees cold sensation. It's not the end of the world. Dude, if you can just, just install it. I was going to say, just put it in there. How much better are Parkers than coats, though? Oh, we'll find out in a second, I guess. We'll check it when it gets finished. Uh, how long? We, how many days do we have left? We we'll make her leave after she's finished this bill. Unless we want more Parkers. Oh, this has been... We, we can survive this, everybody. We can make this through. We can survive this situation. Okay, Parker, let's have a look. So, Parker is installation 32. Wow. That is better, though, right? That is just better. Um, oh, sorry, where's, where am I? Around the same, actually. Around the same. Regardless, though, we need them anyway, because that means we're missing... We need to make her make one more. 
No. Make Parkers and go home. <laughs> you can relax in your palace later. There's an eclipse. That's fine. I'm not using solar power. Also, now where things are kind of looking up a little bit, not too much, a little bit, uh, we also probably want to consider getting a electric stove for the actual cooking place. Hopefully Arthur can stop being a creeper in a second. Getting better. Thank you. Get out. <laughs> Leave. Moth has joined us. Welcome, Moth, to your new home. So what are you good at, Moth? That was it. You were the cook. You're good at handling as well. I guess we put on a four. Hunting. No, you don't, don't hunting. Fishing. Pretty handy, maybe. Research. You can do... Well, you both can do that. Okay, she can be, she can be the permanent cook, though, which is pretty good for us. So we need one of those. I'll make her do cleaning as well, just so she uh, cleans where she's cooking. She doesn't even want an apron. Her temperature range is three degrees, though, which is not very handy right now. Oh, she's fine now. <laughs> Winter mode. Now she's at negative 46. That's perfect. I don't think it goes below 40 in winter normally, unless you're hot further north or there's like some kind of blizzard. So we should be okay now from the temperature. Oh, wait, can you clean first? Wait, wait, wait. That was my mistake. Sorry. Clean first. Oh, and hopefully because she's got a passion, she should get pretty good skills at cooking at some point. Not too worried about the butchering station, but whatever, you can do it if you want. Okay, cool. Wait, you don't need to clean there. Oh, it's because I told her to clean in general, maybe? That might be why. Starvation, Arthur. We do have food, just need to eat it. Okay, I think things are... We're getting there, we're getting there. At least two of the colonists cannot survive winter, which is me and Murray. Uh, Murray makes sense, but what, why Why can I not do it? Oh, I thought she'd be wearing a shirt. Insertion cold, seven degrees. Oh, it's better. That's why. Uh, what else? What can I be Miss Pants? Oh, that counts as that, though. We need pants. Yes, there's no pants. We need to make pants. Uh, where are the pants, everybody? Pants for the pants gods. I can't see the pants. I'm blind, sorry. Give me a second. Uh, -ba -ba. There's also gloves as well we can make. I know there are pants here. I've seen them before and I've, I've made them from here before. Just that right now I'm having a terrible issue. Uh, <laughs> that makes more sense. There you go. I just look up pants. Okay, cool. Things are looking up actually. We may just survive. We're already a third of the way through December. We got quite a lot of food. Probably not too much though. We've also got a random Norwegian forest cat in our butchery as well. And hopefully one moth gets up, she can just start cooking like crazy. Also, how, how are we doing with this? Surely it must be 12 days left. Oh my God, it's such a long, arduous process there. Uh, let's also make sure we build this second wind turbine. To be fair, wind seems quite good in the tundra. It always seems to be windy, so... Sorry about the cut there, everybody. <laughs> I tried to record this, like, pretty much all day, and I actually ran out of space, so it just stopped recording randomly. So, my bad, everybody. My bad, it's fine. Luckily, I managed to reload a save before we lost some progress. But yes, anyway, we're getting quite close to actually being able to survive anyway. Hopefully, we could not get murdered by something horribly. What are we doing? So, we need to make this... We probably also need to make some more clothes because it seems like Arthur cannot go outside. Did I already make a bill for this? Pants. We're doing it already. Perfect. It's all good. 
I can't remember where it got cut off because it just randomly just stopped. I just didn't notice too early. Oh. <gasps> a bear chicken rooster? What the hell is this? Oh my god. I don't think we can kill that. I don't think we can kill that. That's just ridiculous. How are we going to deal with that? Okay, um... We're going to hide inside. We're going to hope for it just disappears. <laughs> no one go outside. You're not allowed. We're not here. I don't know what you mean. There's no humans living here. Look at it. It's terrifying. Oh, it's an owlbear. You get those from uh, Pathfinder and stuff. Yeah, what's its attack damage? 3.86. Not as bad as I thought it would be, actually. Wait, does it give me, does it give me meat? It does. Wait, what's this? A chicken wolf. Oh, my God. Should we try it? Should we try and kill this? Okay, I'm going to stop barking. Let's go outside. No, f wait, I am actually fearful. I am fearful. I was about to say no fear, but that would be a lie, everybody. That would be a lie. I'm terrified of this <laughs> bear chicken. What's this? I'm sorry, I'm bleeding with a bear chicken right now. I can't help you. Its damage isn't that high. It's only 3.75. But I presume its HP is quite ridiculous. And what is this? 2.7. Um, can we do like a... Let's see what happens. <laughs> no! hey Bring it up! Wait, you got no weapon, man. Go back inside. Wait, just run around and hope they don't try and kill you. Run away! <laughs> Wait, if anything, this should be the other way around. Oh no. Oh yes! It died! Okay, kill it, kill it, kill it! Save Moth! It's like a Gatling chicken! Look how quick it's attacking! Moth, 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 get out of this, leave! Leave Moth, leave! <gasps> this is broken! Why would somebody do this? Oh my god, Moth! Moth! Moth, Moth! Oh my god! <laughs> oh! Kill that thing. Murder it. Just kill it in front of it. Just punch it to death. Moth needs help. It's dead. Okay, good. Uh oh. Sorry, a tactical sneeze. It's fine. Okay. Uh, Moth, heal. I think I was better at healing. Slightly. Tend. Oh, this is so bad. Look at all this blood. And there's so many... That chicken wolf is broken, everybody. Why is that even a thing? Oh my... Why would you make this? Somebody tell me why this was created. What point is having a wolf chicken? Okay, I calm down. I'm sorry, boy. I just got... I can't believe that happened. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Uh, she wants me to keep a prisoner for 24 days. No, thank you. We'll see. Let's give it a few seconds, everybody. Let's see if we can actually save Moth before she just dies. I think we might be okay. Because I've already cleaned up most of the bleeding. There's still a lot of bleeding happening, but most of it has been tended. I like how the medic got injured, by the way. We probably should give her some kind of ranged weapon and she just doesn't go near combat. She should be fine, though. I can't believe that happened at the end there. That, what, what the hell was that, man? <laughs> why, why, why is this a thing? It's fine. Don't worry about it. Well, I was about to say it was a good place to stop before I did that. Because it would be nice and like secure and where we were in the game. And then the game just said, no, screw you. I'm going to kill you with a, a bear chicken. Uh, but apart from that, I think we can probably still survive this. Uh, it's been a bit of a chaotic series so far, but that is what I do in a nutshell, everybody. I'm just chaos incarnate. Apart from that, I hope that you have enjoyed watching. As always, please like, subscribe, and comment below, and I'll see you next time. Bye.